Hello everyone. In this video, we shall continue with our lesson on the solid state by learning about the calculation of the density of cubic crystals. Now, in the previous lessons, we have seen that it is possible to calculate the volume of the unit cell by knowing the dimensions such as edge lengths and radii of the elements. The density of a cubic crystal can also be calculated by knowing the edge of the cubic crystal from the X-ray crystallographic studies and by knowing the type of structure possessed by it so that the number of particles per unit cell is known. Now if the edge of the unit cell is denoted by a centimeter cube and the number of atoms per unit cell is denoted by z, the atomic mass of the element is denoted by capital M the volume of the unit cell is equal to a cube since the edges are all of the same length. The density of the unit cell is equal to the mass of the unit cell divided by the volume of the unit cell. Now when we talk about the mass of the unit cell, this is equal to the number of atoms in the unit cell into the mass of each atom. Hence, mass of unit cell is equal to z into small m. Here, small m denotes the mass of each atom. And therefore, the density of the unit cell is given by this equation. Keep in mind that in this case, the edge of the unit cell is in centimeter cube. And therefore, the unit of the density is in grams per centimeter cube. Now, in case the edge length is taken in picometer, then the formula or the relation for density of unit cell is given by this equation. Now, let us go through the different numericals based on the density of the unit cell. 